Right, welcome to this update video for Strikey Scorpion 82 Plus. And that's just to let you know what's been going on in the month of August. Uh, to check out the Plus channel, uh, it's on an independent website now. Uh, it's uh, strikingscorpion82plus.vhx.tv. If you enjoy the content here on YouTube and want to experience more of the battle reports and videos that I make, then uh, you pretty much get double the content there on the Plus channel. You'll see battle reports here on the regular YouTube channel and then uh, over on the Plus channel, the exclusive battle reports there as well. But there's been a lot going on in August. Uh, so you can, if you're on desktop, there is a link just here that will take you to the Plus channel. Uh, or in the video description, this video here, uh, there will be a link to the Plus channel as well. Uh, so I'll just follow the link that's on the uh, YouTube channel homepage. And that takes you to the website here. This is the front page, giving you all the details what to expect you can watch on all these devices no problem and then uh, to sign up there is a seven day free trial on at the moment so you can sample the entire website and all the content there uh, you can just click on here uh, and then put your details in but i'll just go to browse here and then the latest content is just down here so uh coming in at the end of july was a new series subscriber list analysis so if you're subscribed to the plus channel i'll pick someone at random run through one of their lists and uh, break it down and then give an analysis of that that was the end of july then start of august uh, a fresh bad report tau empire versus imperial fists uh, a game of firepower uh, both sides heavily armed with long-range firepower uh, and that was a, a great battle very enjoyable so that was the first battle report there in August. Then we had another subscriber list analysis. It was Megatron's 2000 points of Tau. Uh, so another subscriber list analysis video there. And then sort of alternate the battle reports. Then after that, I'll just go back here. Uh, it was Eldar versus Adeptus Mechanicus. So we got to see the Imperial Knight versus the Wraith Knight. And uh, those two did get very close to each other in the game. And it was a good fight, very enjoyable one. The Killing Fields, we called that one. That uh, was a great battle between those two armies. An experimental list or new list for the Eldar, pressure on them to do well. And the Adeptus Mechanicus at the moment, they're second place on the channel. So reputation for them to uphold as well. So that was the second battle report uh, for August. Then uh, right at the end of the month uh, is the army development for Space Wolves. A, a lot of feedback from that one. Uh, just with the new codex released and the army that I've had boxed up for a while, it's been painted and commissioned uh, by Siege Studios. Got those models out, put a new list together. Uh, they've have a they've had a rough ride. I do plan to develop them further, try and make the Space Wolves into a, a fighting force there. But that's the army development video uh, for Space Wolves there at the end of the month. And just going to September, uh, another battle report, Tau versus Space Wolves, two parts. Part two is on the regular channel. This is part one. Uh, if you want to see those two armies clash and they're well into september now eldar brand new list for them uh and then just released blood angels versus necrons uh two-part series there featuring lazarus dawnhammer uh the new smash captain for the blood angels exciting probably uh, this one part one here and then part two to come on the regular channel probably two of the best games we've played in a long long time always a classic necrons versus blood angels uh, but it was an excellent battle uh, both of those were very good but that's the content there for the plus channel uh, by subscribing uh, you support me in the work that i do and then in return as a reward you get access to all of the content here the full library uh, not just battle reports and army development but uh, all the other content as well there's beat the bear series army development for the different factions the secret project as well which is getting near completion entire army being put together uh, subscriber list analysis you've got the space hulk campaign and then in-depth painting tutorials uh, there to access as well. But there it is. That's the summary for the month of August. Content still rolling out on the Plus channel. Thanks for your support. And uh, why not consider giving uh, a trial uh, on the Plus channel uh, and see what you think of the content. But there it is. That's the update for August. Thanks for watching and tune in next time.